Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Mystic Rose and today we're going to be talking all about your moon in the sign of Gemini. So let's get started. So right away you'll, if you know anything about the sign of Gemini, you know that it is an air sign and it is mutable, meaning that they like change and versatility. They're not a fixed sign. So like with some of the other signs, they're fixed and there's not much change and um, versatility going on. Um, but with Gemini Moon, you love adventure. You have a quick and capable and adaptable mind. You have an interest in whatever is going around or whatever is going on around you. And whenever you've learned something new, you always want to share it with somebody close to you. You have a love for learning. And it's like this newness and excitement that just keeps you going and keeps you thriving. So you love to learn. And also, you're kind of naturally flirtatious, just like with, with anybody. It's, you don't mean to be this way. Um, you don't see it in a sexual way, but um, it's kind of like you're just very flirty with people. You're extremely talented with like word games or anything to do with numbers. You're going to be great at anything like having to do with accounting or keeping score or anything like that. You might also love retail because of your close attention to detail. You might have a lot of gadgets in your house that you have and like to play with. You might be drawn to anything that's bright, shiny, and new. You're kind of hard to pin down in romance because you do like to flirt a lot with a lot of different people and you don't like to settle down easily unless you really, really like somebody. You try to sort of avoid overly emotional experiences. You'd prefer a ra rational or a logical discussion over an emotional one. Because you like to analyze situations. You like to classify things and then move on. So maybe one of the things in this lifetime that you're here to work on is deepening your emotional experiences so that you can learn more about yourself and others. Gemini moons are known for their sense of humor. They are so funny and entertaining. They just instinctively know how to keep things fun. They just have this unquenchable thirst for knowledge and they, they need to find a good balance between like overly researching things and just being content because they are such avid researchers. And um, they need to just try to connect more with others and talk to others about problems or concerns or what makes them tick. Um, because sometimes you can be so in your own head that you forget to think about other people around you and their emotions and what they're going through. You're quite a social butterfly and people like you a lot. And you are fun and exciting. But if you are um, a moon in Gemini, just try to remember that your friends, some of your friends might need to talk about their emotions too, and they may need somebody there to listen to them. And Geminis are just the type of people that they love adventures. So they're the type of friends that you want to have if you like to go and do like new fun things you know try new things they are so personable that they'll get along with just about anybody they're really they're they're not very judgmental people at all they're quite determined but they can be a little bit like, 
cold as far as like in romance goes because they don't like to talk about their feelings that much and so because of that it can kind of complicate their love lives a little bit it's just something that they need to really um, focus on improving and if you have a very jealous partner um, you know, and you are a moon and Gemini person, just be conscientious of that and how they might be feeling. Um, air signs generally um, go well with other air signs. And um, check out your compatibility to see who you would be most compatible with because there may be some signs out there who really wouldn't, care too much if you're that flirty but others would so know which signs would be upset by that and know which ones would be okay with you being overly flirty because if you were with a Scorpio for instance they would not be okay with that because they're very jealous and possessive they're risk takers because taking risks is more fun and more exciting than doing nothing and it could truly lead to some interesting things and so they're open for all kinds of surprises spontaneity enthusiasm um, they love to laugh at a good joke they have some wacky ideas but they're quite energetic and they can be quite refreshing as well I hope that you've enjoyed this video about the moon and Gemini and um, don't forget to tune in to some of my other videos. I've got some other videos that are tarot pick a card readings um, and everything esoteric in my libraries. So um, do be sure to check that out and if you've enjoyed this video, um, please give me a thumbs up, share subscribe and comment i do read all the comments and i love to comment back so please um be aware of that and also if you would like to donate to my channel to keep it going um i never expect that but i fully do appreciate that so if you would like to donate to my channel the information for that is below in the description box and as always, uh, many blessings to you and thanks so much for being my YouTube family.